What's up, everybody? It's Jeremy with Fluge Brothers Chimney Service. It's Fireplace Fridays. I apologize. It usually happens at 10, but we're uh, busy, 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 busy around here. Uh, this uh, Sunday is uh, Brandy, uh, my wife and head office person, manager, extraordinaire, awesome lady, etc., etc., etc. It's her birthday, so on Sunday. So uh, make sure you throw out a happy birthday to her. Um, and uh, we so we set up you know a little table back here and the girls did a great job uh, uh, doing some decorations I made biscuits and gravy for the staff this morning uh, and uh, we had a good time so uh, I was cleaning up after that we're doing our normal Friday cleaning um, uh, I'm sitting here checking email now and I uh, get a kick out of uh, all of these uh, uh, coronavirus uh, readiness and emails and everything basically everybody's saying the same thing hey we're still doing business hey we clean our stuff hey we take measures blah 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 i hope you always took the same measures uh yeah, we do too uh, we, we've always taken the same measures so, I and mean, check it out we we provide hand sanitizer for all the employees they're in their trucks because not only are we you know are we we're just worried about them catching you know the flu period we offer flu shots reimbursements through our company and all that stuff so it's business as usual around here of course we're of course we're taking measures of course you know we're doing stuff so you know uh, nothing's gonna slow us down everything's fine um, you know the of course there's always concern and there's stuff in the media and everything I get it you know uh, uh, everybody's doing their research there's millions of posts online people are either joking to put people at ease or they're freaking out or what have you yeah, like I said however you need to deal with it deal with it but of course keep a level head um, help out with community um, you know they've talked about shutting down schools from after uh, spring break a little bit and a lot of people uh, you know we have a lot of people at work here and uh, they, they've got to have they've got to have babysitters and stuff so you know hopefully uh, this this whole thing you know creates more of a uh, stronger community people help each other out uh, and uh, you know things of that nature because you still got to work you still gotta uh, we still got to provide you know uh, all this stuff it creates a trickle effect um, but uh, we're still working we're not gonna stop working we're gonna rock on we got a lot of work to do uh, this time of year we get into a lot of brick work um, <clears throat> and uh, so we're doing, we're having to, and it takes a lot to do brick work. A lot of people, uh, uh, most people don't don't um, complain about the price or what have you. They uh, they realize, you know, not only do we, do we have to go and try to find a, a matching brick, um, but we have to. Uh, get all the scaffold set up all that material has to be moved up to the roof safely you got to put up a bunch of protection and uh, then uh, you know we have to try to match the mortar best we can there's a lot that goes into it. it's truly an art form um, I can show you bad brickwork all over town bad tuck pointing jobs everything but we strive to make it look the best we can um, of course you can't match every single brick perfectly because they don't make any of the brick that are on chimneys or anything anymore they have similar so we always get the closest similar or we let the homeowner go pick it out if they want to be um, part of the process it's uh, yeah it's very nice we work with a couple brickyards uh, they make life a lot easier on us things of that nature so um, so good stuff uh, good stuff we're working on we're pushing on we're gonna uh, keep on working keep everybody employed around here uh, have a great summer um, you know uh, get through the uh, side stuff uh, like I said, I, I, I'm about four emails deep and I just find it hilarious. This is Chase, my credit card, sending me a deal saying that, uh, hey, uh, we're uh, doing all we can to keep the branches open. Uh, everybody's washing their hands, thank God. And, uh, you know, we're doing a good job keeping everything clean. I, I, it's, it's interesting to me why, you know, I mean, it, it, of course you are, of course you are. But uh, I think I think everybody's overreacting a little bit everybody needs to keep a nice calm head um, and uh, business as usual on everything uh, we got to keep the communities going and everything yeah someone just like that and it should be liked um, everybody's got to work everybody's got to provide because you take away you take away the chimney sweep and you know no one cleans chimneys you take away uh, the uh, anything uh, you take away the guy that uh, that uh, picks up the trash 
and trash starts piling up and everything. So if anything, like I said, um, we, we, everybody just needs to um, band together, help everybody else out as a community. Um, we've got a, a nice gal that works here that has a kid in daycare. And if they shut down the daycare, hey, we're going to have to change up a little bit and let her bring um, the, her uh, child to work because she's got to work. Everybody's got to work. So keep supporting everybody. Keep calling everybody. Exactly. Stay calm. Wash your hands. Well, duh, everybody wash your hands. You should always wash your hands. You know, uh, just, yeah, take your regular measures, stay clean, and all that good stuff. But... Like I said, um, uh, business as usual, keep utilizing services. I'm gonna keep using, we got the alarm company coming out next week to do some maintenance on our alarms around here. You know, keep, everybody needs to keep on working and keep going. You can't just sit around and, and crawl into a hole somewhere. Um, you know, it, we, we do need to keep everybody uh, working, not just the chimney sweeps. We need to keep everybody working, the postal people and uh, sanitation people, the trash men, the garbage men, the people at the grocery stores, everything. Uh, you know, spend more time with family. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. I, 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 I brought up a couple of good things that are coming out of this. One, um, you know, uh, for our business, it's good because it's going to be good because people are going to spend more time at home. When people spend more time at home, they start looking around the house and go, man, I really like to get that fixed or that redone or, hey, it'd be nice to have a nicer fireplace or, boy, it's a bit chilly today. Uh, it'd be nice to be able to just uh, hit a remote and turn some, and turn the fireplace on and hit a remote and turn it off. And it provides us some good heat, so I think that's gonna that's gonna be a good thing. Um, the other good thing about it is, is when you stay home, uh, you know, you drag out some board games, uh, cook some meals at home, uh, spend more time with family. So that's that's a good thing too. So um, you do want to be, uh, you know, uh, we always want to help others out in our community, but at the same time, um, always help out at home first and uh, spend time with each other. It's great. Uh, it, it'll be nice. Don't just stay there glued in front of the TV or glued on the internet, glued on social media, because you don't want that bad energy dragging you down with everybody else. And try not to be that bad energy person either. So, uh, you know, this is a new thing for us all, and uh, we just got to take it day by day, no problem. Like I said, everything's gonna gonna be just fine. Uh, all right, well. Uh, that's my little uh, tidbit. Um, like I said, we're into masonry season. We're getting into masonry season. Weather's starting to warm up a little bit. So if you need some uh, brick repairs, we, we deal with chimneys so far. We only deal with chimneys. We specialize in chimneys. So if you got some other brick repairs on your house or uh, wing walls or whatever, we, we don't dive into that. We stick with chimneys. But um, we're very, very good at what we do. So uh, if you need any of that work or anything, give us a holler. Um, if you're watching this from somewhere else, uh, give your local chimney sweep a holler. Uh, if you have chimney related things, uh, if you get leaks, that's another thing that happens this time of year. We can talk about leaks next week or the week after. But uh, uh, don't call a roofer. Uh, if it's coming in around the chimney, call the experts, uh, the experts of chimney sweeps. Um, best resource for that is the Chimney Safety Institute of America, www.csia.org. Um, if you're outside of the Kansas City area, of course, if you're in the Kansas City area, use Blues Brothers. That's us. 913-236-7141 is the phone number uh, here Monday through Friday. Uh, girls answer the phones 8 a.m. to 4 uh, 4 30 p.m. every every day Monday through Friday so more than happy to help you out um, I'm gonna jump back to it it's Friday I want to get a lot of work done I've got my son's birthday tomorrow and Brandy's birthday on Sunday so it's gonna be a busy weekend and I've got to do some running around so see you next week wash your hands <laughs> hey Jerry Eisenhower uh, do all the good stuff stay positive and uh, we'll see you next week bye